the spectacular Scarlet Spider. What's up guys, Spectacular Scarlet Spider 118 here. Today I have a couple of updates and an announcement for my next costume. So uh, first things first, as always, white noise in the background, fans running, it's summer, it's, it gets hot. Uh, second thing, uh, I have not worn this costume in a very long time. Uh, PS4 cane suit, one of my mo uh, more underrated suits. Uh, patterned by Joel House, obviously faced up by Ewan Zonkos. Um, let me know if you want to see a review of this suit at some point, because uh, I'm still going back through my old costumes to do reviews of. Uh, so, yeah. And third thing is, I'm sorry I haven't been making that many videos, I just haven't had much to talk about. And I'll get into why in a second, but, you know, my last, like, real video, because I did the cosplay showcase, but the last real video I did was talking about the new Bennett Riley suit and how I really wanted to get that. Um, and so for the past couple of weeks, you know, I've had Logan eat yourself off a of cliff. He, he started making the pattern and, uh, I'm helping him out with it, like giving him some tips because there's some things I was like, ah, you need to make that a little bit more accurate. So like, it's a work in progress sort of thing. So that thing's going to take a while. And I kind of realized that. And so my whole thing with that suit is that I was like, I was getting really like impatient with it. Cause I was like, I want to cosplay this. I want to do it. I want to do it. I want to do it. Yeah. <laughs> and so I was thinking to myself, well, I want it to be right, you know, I want it to be accurate, and so Logan's taking his time on that like he should, uh, and so another thing about that is that I'm going back up to school soon, so I wanted to have the costume like ASAP so I could get before school review and, you know, have a good summer with that and all that, but uh, now I'm like, okay, I want to take, take your time on it, and so that means I'm not going to like have that, uh, I don't have that window of time frame to do that within like a month uh, now. So I'm like, okay, so I will, I will move on to the next in line in my cosplans, which is actually my good friend Alex, uh, Gaston Patterns. Well, he doesn't run Bet Gaston Patterns anymore because his computer, uh, like, is dead or whatever. He's just, he's just not doing patterns anymore. He's not making any patterns. But, you know, Gaston Spidey, Gaston Patterns, whatever you want to call himself, uh, or whatever you want to call him. Uh, <laughs> referring to him as if I'm talking to him. Um... But he, uh, you know, made a classic pattern for Spider-Man, uh, really great design, but uh, he made me a version in light blue, and so I'm going to go to print costume, and I'm going to get my first print costume costume, and it's going to be that suit, print costume costume, that just doesn't sound right. Uh, so yeah, um, I, I will be using the, the sponsorship thing to do that, because I'm broke, and the reason I'm broke is because of the LEGO Daily Beagle set, which I'm looking at right now, it's across from me. And I know I said that I'd do a review of that, but I don't think that's going to happen mostly because it doesn't really fit with the vibe of the rest of, like, the content on this channel. But who knows, I might. If you guys really want to see it, I'll do it. But, um, yeah, so I'll have my first print costume of uh, suit. Uh, it'll be, you know, the classic pattern. And it will be on Color Fabrics. Um, now, I, I emailed a uh, print costume. I'm so used to saying Zentezone. But I emailed them the other night asking them how many points I have for the discount code. By the way... Again, please use code SCAR118 as, uh, I almost said Zentazen, at print costume for 15% off your order. Not only does that help you save 15% off your order, but it also helps me make content and get suits, uh, to do reviews of. So if you really want to see, like, if print costume's worth it or not, like, because that's kind of the, the question up in the air right now, since they changed from Zentazen to print costume. Now I've heard that they're pretty much the same thing, but we'll see, uh, what, I, I know they've made a couple of changes here and there, so I'm gonna get my first print costume suit, hopefully it'll get here before I have to move back up to school, but, uh, if it doesn't, then it will be very shortly after that, sometime in August, I would say, but hopefully I can do it by the end of July, um, so yeah, that's, that's gonna be pretty interesting, obviously, you know, like I said, color fabric, uh, classic suit, light blue, um, I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be making lenses for it again. I'm going to kind of uh, try to do it Ramos style. I know a lot of people hate Ramos' art, but, uh, you know, I get it. Like, the way he draws proportions is very weird, but I've always loved the way he draws Spider-Man's lenses. They're kind of almost Dicko-esque, but, like, on a larger scale, if that makes sense. So, that it, I, I really appreciate that about his art. Um, so, I'm going to be doing that for my classic suit, uh, made by Gaston Patterns. And, uh, yes, yeah, so that's pretty interesting. So, um, uh, if print costume, they haven't emailed me back, I'm assuming they'll do that pretty shortly here, because I'm recording at night, and they usually get back within, like, this time of day, or night, so, uh, you know, I'll, I'll see how many points I have, and I'll let you guys know, uh, if, or when, because it will happen, when that's going to happen, uh, and I'm excited for that, so I'll have update videos about that, and I will have, uh, update, um, or not update, I'll have a suit review letting you guys know, like, print costumes, actual, like, quality, uh, if there's anything with that, 
Um, also, a couple of side updates, like, off to the side. Leonardo is going very well. Um, I know I, like, don't really do updates about on this channel because that'd be, like, way too much for me to do. But, uh, it's going very well. I'm almost done with it. There's a couple of things I want to do. Uh, some surprises I want to throw in there as well with it before I, like, call it finished. So, I, that will be done within the, uh, the next week. I want to say the next week or two, it depends, because, you know, painting weather gets crazy, rain, you know, that can delay stuff, but, uh, yeah, so, when that's done, I know I haven't been doing updates on it, I will have a, like, actual, I wouldn't call it a review, because I can't really review something that's, like, not being sold, but it'll basically kind of just be me going over the suit, kind of like the Vader helmet thing I did, um, I mean, that was a pseudo review, but, like, It'll be in the style of a, of a review where I'll go over each and every part uh, and go into detail about how I made it and uh, some other stuff. So uh, be on the lookout for that. Hopefully that drops sometime soon. And I also forgot, I lost my train of thought when I was talking about the lenses earlier. I will have a lenses tutorial for the first time. Uh, so my friend uh, Spence, Nerdy Spencey, he, <laughs> like a year ago, asked me if, he, if I was going to make a lens tutorial video. And I just, like I wanted to, but I never had like, I was never making lenses at a good time uh, when I when when making videos uh, or normal lenses because these past couple lenses I've made like uh, well it's right here actually threats and menaces and and uh, all new all different they they don't have normal lenses with so I can't tell you guys the process of that because that was experimental stuff and I'm not like maybe in the future I'll do videos on that like colored lenses and uh, light up eyes but I will for the first time have a lens tutorial sometime soon. Um, and so hopefully that will be up, uh, probably, no, it'll probably be after my, my classic suit review, because I'll have to show gl me gluing it onto the mask and a couple other things, and so yeah, it'll be after my classic suit review, so, I know that's a bunch of mumbo jumbo probably right now, but it'll all make sense later, so, so thanks for watching, like and subscribe, share the video, follow me on Instagram, at Spectacular Squad, Spar, use code scar 118 at printcostume.com for 15% off your order, not only does that help you save money, but it also helps me push out content for this channel so you guys can see that print costume is hopefully truly worth it because I haven't gotten the suit from them yet. So anyways, uh, yeah, Spectacular Scorespire, 118, out. See you guys.